Morning guys, welcome to Do Daily. Wake up to walk, it's Des here. Looking to attack the day. It's not gone to plan so far, it really hasn't. I'm up later than normal. The arm, as you can see, still giving me a lot of jip. Still really, really hurting, still um, really painful. So it's kept me awake a lot of the night. So couldn't get up first thing. Got lots planned today, so it was important for me to get some sleep. Otherwise, I'd have been really struggling for the rest of the day. And I thought it'd be just worth it to take my time, get out when I can. It's kind of early, well, not early morning, it's mid-morning now. I'm out and about, just by the embankment, walking around the gardens. Really, really nice. It's been wet as well this morning, so possibly dodged a few showers. So small wind there, but I'm up now, up ready to attack the things I'm doing. And I am attacking it whilst I've been out for a walk. I've got a few errands to do, a few jobs to get done before I settle in for the weekend and try and enjoy it the best I can. And that's what Friday mornings are all about, aren't they? Waking up, coming to terms with everything, looking forward and getting into good activity as early as you possibly can. For me this week, whilst it's not as early as normal, it's as early as I possibly can to make it work going forward. I mentioned there, I'm by the river. I'll just pop out in a second, you'll see it. Normally I'd be on the Robin Hood way, looking to finish that off. Do you know, I've been doing that, it seems like forever now, but really keen to get it finished, but just one or two things. And of course this week, the arm has sort of restricted me a little bit in getting up there. Do you know, I'd love to get up there this morning. Got a little bit more time today um, due to the fact I'm not at work. And it had been great to sort of look to get some good mileage in. So that's not quite gone to plan, but it's not to worry about, is it? Just like this, the arm, do you know, that's not to worry about either. It's just, uh, it's just a case of trying to remain positive, trying to remain on top form, do you know, and keep sort of looking ahead, do you know, and wanting to sort of make the most of everything. That's the frame of, my, frame of mind I'm in this week. It's kind of been the theme when we started off on Monday, do you know, about just pushing on one or two tricky situations to encounter. And of course, the fall on Wednesday and hurting my, hurting my arm, do you know. It'd be easy to be a little bit fed up, a little bit sort of annoyed with it. And it is, don't get me wrong, it's frustrating, it hurts a lot. Um, and, and every time I move it because it's not broken, I forget that it is actually hurting and I kind of squeal. But anyway, regardless of all that, you know, it doesn't mean I, 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 I have to let it define me. What I have to do is just work with it. Sometimes things are thrown up on us and, and a definite theme this week has been the fact that I've said how aware I've been that things will happen you know, because they always do. They always, something's always sent to try us. So this is just it at the moment, isn't it? Do you know, so I have to deal with it the absolute best I can and really, really sort of stay calm. That was the theme definitely on Wednesday. And that's what I'm doing, do you know? It'd be easy to wind myself up about not getting up early, not sticking to all the routines that I like to through do daily. But I'm still doing it. It's still sort of, I'm readjusting, you know, moving the goalpost slightly, but doing it in a, the same thing in a different way. Whilst I missed out on a lot of sleep, I got some sleep sort of when I shouldn't have been asleep. So now it's still a case of getting up and enjoying my surroundings, you know, as well as ticking those jobs off, you know, and that'll make me feel better knowing I've, I've been able to do them. It'll make me feel like I've achieved something this morning and that's all it's really about, isn't it? You know, Friday mornings are a funny one, aren't they? We're all looking ahead to the weekend. We're all keen to crack on with the enjoyable stuff. 
if you don't work of course of course a lot of people have to and I'm sure they look at their time off when they can but for myself it's the weekend when lots of the plans come together or I get to go to football or London or like today both something that really excites me of course football is my real passion but I love going to London and whilst it's kind of a fleeting visit just a an overnighter I'll throw in a park run if I can probably be a park walk because because of my arm you know and again I'm just doing all the things I want to do and all I'm trying to do today guys is highlight that we don't have to miss out completely there's ways of doing things and whilst it might not be you might not get 100% satisfaction from them it's better than not doing them at all isn't it it's better than not doing anything do you know because when you don't do anything do you know you just sit sort of sit back feel sorry for yourself regret it moan groan and grumble and the reality is we don't have to do that do you know we've got things we can get something from and at times you just have to accept that it's not about getting that 100 satisfaction things are sent to try us you know and that's the way it is but for me look at this today it's been absolutely throwing it down this morning but i'm now down by the trend and the colors are amazing so what i lost on the robin hood way just sort of reiterating that point i make up for in getting out here you know getting things done sorry for the extreme close-up my arm's really aching and of course I can only use one um, but yeah that's what it's all about guys really sort of keen to emphasize that you know it's it's easy to beat ourselves up and of course whilst I, I look to sort of discuss mental health in a light-hearted way through this do you know I've, I'm really noticing how it could really be affecting me right now do you know it could really really be um, getting to me do you know because in in small moments if I'm totally honest, it does. It really, really sort of irritates me that I can't do the things I want to. But in the big, in the, with the bigger picture, looking at the bigger picture, you know, it's only a temporary thing. Do you know, it'll get better. And thankfully, as it's not broken, do you know, it'll get better quicker than I thought it would do initially. Do you know, but it's about maintaining those positive thoughts, isn't it? I've got to keep those going. Do you know, on... Wednesday night when I did it I said I had to stay calm and relaxed and hope it had not been broken and that sort of positivity kind of paid off didn't it because ultimately it didn't I say a lot if you want to enjoy something and make the most of it you need to go into it wanting to enjoy it and make the most of it a lot of the time people will say oh, I'm not feeling great I'm not on top of things well if that's your attitude you know you're just going to take that with you aren't you especially if you're doing something you think you want to enjoy but you're going in with that attitude do you know that's that's kind of defeating the purpose of <laughs> enjoying something isn't it of planning something of doing something you like do you know you've got to go into it feeling absolute tip top for me whilst i've got the issue here do you know i'm going into the weekend a weekend where i can do football park run you know we've, we've got a night out back here in nottingham tomorrow as well something we've been waiting for for 18 months an artist who we've seen a long long time ago and we wanted to go back and see and again covid was the classic example of sort of making us wait sometimes wasn't it changing situations changing what we can do and when we can do it but what it's done for me if i learned anything through that whole period it's just given me a bit more patience you know there were bigger issues than when we could see this artist or when we could do this or that you know there was a lot more worrying and concerning and as somebody who likes to think they think of others you know that was more important than me getting to enjoy myself you know right now things are coming back to us you know things are allowed to happen you know so why wouldn't we look forward to them despite minor blips you know it's a case of pulling yourself out of them I've already sort of regrettably flicked through social media this morning seen one or two posts where people are moaning and I get I know I get a bit of flack for the amount I post the positive stuff 
Oh, here he is again, happy clapping. But the reality is, why would you put shit on there? Why would you moan? Do you know, because that doesn't say anything about anything, does it? Do you know, at least I'm wanting to enjoy myself and wanting to be positive and going into another weekend, do you know, that's so important. I've really, really enjoyed the fact I've not done it the way I should do it this morning now. Do you know, having said what I've said, having enjoyed the river and the sunshine and got these jobs done, do you know, so that's great, isn't it? Do you know, I could have wrote on social media, oh, it's not gone to plan, it's not done this, do you know, but, but what does that achieve? It still means you've got to go and do it. So that's what I want to say, guys, just stay positive, stay calm, stay calculated uh, in a good way. <laughs> not in a manipulative way, but stay calm, you know, and things will just happen, things will just fall into place, you know, and that's what it's all about, isn't it? Making things work for you, enjoying them the absolute best you can, have a fantastic weekend. If it's not going to plan, get out for a walk, get out for a run, get out for some activity. When you do that, I can assure you, everything will feel 100 times better. Just turning away from the sun there before I go. But that's me done for the week. Do you know I've got those exciting plans ahead? Looking forward to a few days without do daily as much as I love it. You know, you all know that by now. I wouldn't go without it, even when it's difficult and I'm walking around with one arm out of use and the other one out of use because I've got the selfie stick, do you know. I'm not going to miss it because I don't have to. And that's the point, isn't it? Do what works for you. Really, really enjoy the weekend. Please like, share and subscribe. Bit of a tricky one again for me to navigate, but hopefully the message has come across and I'll see you on the other side. Just doing it.